course I'm always late. Let's go spar with the Aljo. Last night I don't get a good sleep, but let's see how I'm gonna do with Aljo. He's especially big now. What's up, Chunk Master? My weight's coming down. I don't know about you. I don't know what you talk about right now. I'm a little boy now. What do you weigh today? 64.7. Trending in the right direction. As for followers say, trust the process. My lungs are hating me right now. My arms are heavy thinking about it. I'm kind of coming off the couch, guys. <laughs> are you in shape? Definitely not. But I did some light sparring on Saturday, so I think that's gonna help kind of get the juices going a little bit. I'm gonna hit him with one of these. And I'm gonna shake a little bit, and I'm gonna come back like that. It's always tough, doesn't matter how good shape Aljo is. He said he thinks he only has two rounds in him today. He said before, he said he'll get tired in the third round. So do you think you think you're gonna beat him up in the third round? No, not beat him up. I don't know. He may get tired, but he's too tough. You know, it's okay. Tired doesn't mean it's gonna be easy. Try to give him a rub as close to a realistic Pio de Gano look as I possibly can. And I try to throw hard punches the way he's gonna throw it. At the end of the day, even if I catch him in here, the point is to see it, train it, be ready for it. So when you're out there, it's like slow motion. You drill it, you see what they're good at, then their tendencies, and you break it down from a analytical standpoint to your strengths. And even if that's not your game, at least if you understand theirs, it gives you a better idea of what you want to do when those situations do arrive and you know from all the mistakes you made in here and what you had success with in here, what's your high percentage of tax. You just drill it till it's like habitual. What is it, like five weeks out? Get to see those looks. Good to see those looks. Now I feel great, but during the sparring, I was a little tired. I mean, he wasn't training hard, so he gave me top, top three rounds. And after I stay to the class and I keep finish rounds, I did good, you know. During the sparring, like I said, I was a little tired, but now I'm good, I feel good. Life is good, you know. Sometimes we have tough, tough days, My, our body is beat up, but we gotta push hard and we gotta make it to finish. That's how it's gonna be in the fight. Uh, my fight won't be easy, but I gotta push hard and make it to end there. But number one, we need to raise our hand, you know, we need to raise our hand, we need to win. Uh, number one is this. So. I'm training, I'm doing all the hard work, the result should be good, the result will be good.